Welcome back to Error Genie. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to fix controller not working in Dragon Ball Sparking Zero on PC. Let's dive into the step-by-step -step guide to get things sorted. Step 1. Close DS4 Windows app. If you're using the DS4 Windows app, start by closing it. You can do this by right-clicking on the DS4 Windows icon in the system tray and selecting Exit. After closing the app, relaunch the game and see if your controller is working. Step 2. Disable Steam input. Open Steam and right-click on the game that's having controller issues. Select Properties, then go to the Controller tab. In the settings, change from Use Default Settings to Disable Steam input. Relaunch the game and check if the controller works. If not, you can try the opposite. Enable Steam input and test again. Step 3. Use Steam Big Picture mode. Open Steam and click on the Big Picture Mode icon in the top right corner. Once you're in Big Picture Mode, launch the game and check if the controller issue is resolved. Step 4. Disconnect and reconnect your controller. Simply unplug your controller and plug it back in. If you're still having issues, try disconnecting other external devices like HOTAS, wheels, pedals, or other controllers that might be interfering. If you have multiple monitors, disconnect the extra ones and try running the game on a single monitor. Step 5. Manage Virtual Controllers If you're using any virtual controllers, example VJoy Virtual Gamepad, either uninstall or disable them, and then relaunch the game. Step 6. Use a wired connection If none of the above steps work, try connecting your controller using a USB cable to ensure it's properly recognized by your system. These steps should help you fix controller not working in Dragon Ball. Sparking Zero on PC. If you found this guide useful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Error Genie for more troubleshooting tips. Thanks for watching.